Hey Stampers, welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey, part of the Stampin' Jill Creative team, and today I'm excited to share with you a stamp set and punch from the mini catalog. This is the stamp set that I'm working with, the Hello Ladybug set, as well as the Ladybug punch. These are so fun and they coordinate and go together so well. Um, the Ladybug stamp set is so cute and I love it used as a ladybug. Let me show you some samples with that that we've come up with. So cute. So here's one just with the stamping. The punch isn't used there. This one is just with that cute daisy flower. So cute. Here's one with the punches. So you can see it just lines up and is so cute. On this one, actually, I used the wings as leaves as well. Another one. Here's one she's taking off and flying. And a shaker card. It's so much fun to be used as a ladybug, obviously, because that's what it's meant to be used as. But I wanted to come up with some other ways that you could use this punch and stamp set in more ways than just the ladybug. So I wanted to show you some ideas doing that. First, I'm going to stamp with you. So we're gonna make a card all together. We're gonna start with our piece of basic white hair. And these are the polka dots that normally would go on our ladybug. But I'm gonna use them to create a background on this card because I think when you can have a stamp that does multiple things for you, you just can't go wrong. So I'm just gonna take this and just stamp all over the back of this cardstock and just kind of create a cute little polka dot background. I like to kind of move my stamp all around so I'm getting all the different ways that it can go. Just like that. Kind of cute, it kind of looks like a little Dalmatian, a little bit, okay? And then I'm going to stamp my saying. We'll get this little bit of stamping done. You can bug me anytime. The nice thing about this one is that it's photopolymer, so I can line it up pretty easily on this teeny piece of basic white. Awesome, you can bug me anytime. Okay, now I wanna create something that's not a ladybug. So we're going to make a bumblebee. So I have some black cardstock and just a little strip of yellow cardstock. And we're just going to take some Stampin' Seal and adhere this strip just along this black cardstock in three straight lines and then snip off the extra. So one there, one here. I don't want them too far apart. And then one more, just like that, okay? And then we're going to take our ladybug punch and I'm going to, well, you can see it's not going to go this way. I wanna punch it this way. So I'm just gonna trim my black piece here down so that it'll fit in there. It all works out. Okay, just like that. So I wanna line up my black piece in there. Trim a little more off. It's gonna work, I promise. Just like that so that you can see the cute little yellow stripes on my little bumblebee, okay? And then our bumblebee needs some wings. So I'm going to use some of our supple shimmer paper, the glimmer paper that's in the mini catalog, the blue piece, and I'm just going to punch out some little bumblebee wings, just like that. Okay, 
Now let's put our card together. So we're going to adhere down our white background piece that we created just in the center of our card. And then we're going to adhere our saying onto a piece of pool party as well. Just like that. And then I've already cut out a circle from our circles dies in the Pell Papaya. And we'll just put that on top of there. And let me bring in the finished card here. You can see how cute that's gonna turn out. So much fun and you have a cute little bumblebee instead of a ladybug. So let me show you two other card ideas that I've made using different designs using the ladybug punch. Okay, so here's one with a butterfly. You can see I just used the wings and created butterfly wings. And I still used the little antenna in the back. And then we have some flowers. So I just, I just um, die cut out a circle and lined the flowers all on the back and then even used that wings for the leaves there. So cute. The Hello Ladybug stamp set and the Ladybug punch are so versatile and there's so many different options of things you can make with it. I've had so much fun playing with this and I hope that you do too. We've shared on our blog, stampinjill.com, some of these other ideas, so if you want to go and check them out there, you should do that. If you have any questions, let us know. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you next week for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.